for today's experiment is verify de morgan's theorems there are two uh, de morgan's theorems the first one is a or b the whole bar is equal to a bar ended with d bar while writing the statement it is complement of sum is equal to product of their individual complements okay so we have to design two circuits that is left hand side and right hand side now in the left hand side what we have is a or b the whole bar so a or b the whole bar this is the logic equation for nor gate so what we require is nor ic that is 7402 and while the designing the right hand side it is a bar dot b bar so first what we require is the complement of a as well as complement of b so input a and b is given to the not gates so output is this is a bar and output of this is b bar so a bar and b bar are given to the inputs to and gate and gate means it is 7408 so what output we are getting is a bar ended with b bar so okay so we will design this so we require ic 7402 and for right hand side first we require 7404 and the second one 7408 so while placing this ic is just uh, take care that this notch should be towards the left side so below pin that is a upper lower side uh, left side is pin number 1 okay now first we have to give uh energy to all ic's so this is vcc line and this one is ground line so for each and every ic pin number 7 is ground and pin number 14 is vcc so short all these pin number 7 of all ic's to ground line similarly pin number 14 is vcc line so short all pin number 14s to plus 5 volt that is vcc line so now we gave power supply to each and every ic now while connecting what we required is input a is given to pin number 2 of ic 7402 so this is ic 7402 so this is input a it is connected to pin number 2 and input b is connected to pin number 3 okay and output is taken from pin number 1 so this is the output is taken from pin number 1 okay so this is the left hand side similarly we have to connect for right hand side so same input a is given to pin number 1 of not gate that is ic 7404 so this is the a input from here only it is connected to pin number 1 of ic 7404 and b input is connected to pin number 3 of ic 7404 so this is the b input and from b input it is connected to pin number 3 now 
ए बार इज एट पिन नंबर टू ऑफ आई सी सेवन फोर जीरो फोर सो पिन नंबर टू इज कनेक्टेड टू पिन नंबर वन ऑफ आई सी सेवन फोर जीरो एट दैट इज एंड गेट एंड पिन नंबर फोर दैट इज बी बार इज कनेक्टेड टू पिन नंबर टू ऑफ आई सी सेवन फोर जीरो एट सो पिन नंबर फोर ऑफ आई सी सेवन फोर जीरो फोर इज कनेक्टेड टू पिन नंबर टू ऑफ आई सी सेवन फोर जीरो एट आउटपुट इज टेकन फ्रॉम पिन नंबर थ्री ऑफ आई सी सेवन फोर जीरो एट सो दिस इज द आउटपुट इट इज टेकन फ्रॉम द पिन नंबर थ्री ऑफ आई सी सेवन फोर जीरो एट so this is the complete circuit design now just we have to verify the output on the hmm. so for input 0 0 led is on so it is logic 1 okay and left hand side and right hand side both are logic 1 when input a is 0 and b is 1 That time both the LEDs are at off state, so it is logic zero. Okay, when input A is one, output is zero. That time also both are at logic zero, and when both the inputs are one, then also output is zero. Okay, so this is verification of D Morgan's first law. If we want to check the output voltage. we can connect this dmm with respect to ground so this is common terminal is connected to this ground and output is connected over here that is for left hand side so when it is 0 0 inputs are 0 0 led is in on state output is 3.68 volt if it is 0 1 led is in off state output voltage is 0.15 when input is 1 a is 1 and out, B is zero. That time also LED is in off state. Voltage is zero point one five three volt. And for both inputs one, output is zero and in voltage output voltage is zero point one five two volt. That is almost zero volt.